Hello again, brothers and sisters. Jack Talkai here. <laughs> to discuss how to live without fear. and Because I thought it would be fun. <laughs> I want to talk about a bunch of things. I know where I want to start. Honestly, I don't know where it's going to take us. Um, I'm going to allow the truth to flow through me. But I had a couple of recent conversations. I had a few conversations recently. kind of inspired me. Allowed me to share some of my story. And, you know, I thought, hey, why not? I'll just try and put some of this stuff together and see. See what helps. What, what makes sense. All I can do is try. But see, I know for a fact, I know for a fact, plenty of evidence tells me my life is an example. It's an example for others to follow. Not exactly like me. God, no. But to learn from the things that I did. So here I am. Apparently, I've become the guy sitting in bed doing a YouTube video. Last time I brought up, you know, as an example for, uh, for the people who focus on money, you know. I've had a lot of people tell me, you should go get a job, Jack. You should go get a job. Go apply for some aid. <laughs> <laughs> well, should I? Should I really? Hmm. Okay. It's one idea. Um, <laughs> God. Back to my thoughts. The other example I want to point out to is there's some amazing guys. Ralph Smart, Infinite Waters, uh, Mark Passio. Can't remember his stuff. Names that should be heard from, learned from. Based on quality, they put a lot of effort into production, learning production, and and you know. Should should have some pride, but uh, probably stressed a lot about production and take a lot of credit for that. I'm not stressing, man. <laughs> you get what you get. I am who I am. I'm perfectly where I'm supposed to be. To believe otherwise would be just ludicrous. So here I am. At a place in my life I never, never thought I would be. <laughs> with, with like, fucking... Faith and excitement? I got faith and excitement over what might be possible if I didn't um, care about people's opinions, you know? And just laid in bed and shared some wisdom that I learned. Shit, anything's possible, man. I stopped believing things were not possible. Settled into just what really is. What really is, the only thing that is, is right now. It's all that ever was. 
So, I remember, I mean, I'm living in the same house. I'm laying in the same bed. I'm laying in the exact same bed where a few years ago I was trying to drink myself to death. Nothing has changed in this world. <laughs> well, everything's changed. See, in my past, I had a good, comfortable job. Shared time with my son when it was agreed upon. Kind of. Shared time with my son when it was available. I denied myself love. Failed to give attention to the people I cared about. I felt completely alone in this world. Had a good secure job, maxed out at the pay scale, thinking, great, there's nothing better than this. This is horrible. And it kind of was, man. Wage slavery is slavery. <laughs> I oppose slavery. I oppose oppression. I'm all about nature and balance. Love. I've always been about love. I just didn't understand it. Love's confusing, but really, love is all that there is. Love is what formed us, right? <laughs> all of time and nature. I could go on and on. Love is simple. Simple is perfect. Accept perfection and find the simple. That's kind of the way to live without fear and to live with Christ in your heart. Praise the God that allows you the moments of your life. Choose how you feel about what's revealed and what you do. You learn from the past. Use the past for ideas on how to improve. You know, and on the present, in the present, look for things to inspire you, to excite you, to fulfill desires. Enjoy the hell out of your life. It's your life to live, how you want, how you choose. I've been very, very clear about what I've chosen to do and try, what I've been trying to do. No one seemed to care whatsoever. I'm like, hey, let's, let's get together. Let's end wars. Let's see what we can do. I'm totally alone, man. I'm like, what? But I got <laughs> God's plans, God's control, man. But I I figured that out too. 
Everything outside of me is outside of my control. Okay? So there's an infinite intelligence that I can explain. I call it God. You know, the infinite intelligence that reveals the future and now. That God is beyond our minds. But it's all of our mind. That's what God is. is you're within the mind of God, so maybe act like it. Show a little gratitude for the fact that you live and see what you can do. There's a lot of suffering going on. Oh yeah, you know, and that's another thing. Dude, my life is filled with problems. I got so many things I should do. Oh, and around me in my community, there's so much suffering. And my goal is to end the wars, but here I am. I'm not helping anybody. I'm just laying in bed, <laughs> making a video. How do you know what to do? How do you know when you know? How do you know when you've be done becoming you? How do you know what you might become? Where might you go? What might you do? Huh. You never do know. Anyway. I could go on and on, but seriously, I am. I'm seeking conversations. If anyone wants to give me a call, I'll try to link the names that I mentioned in the video. They're men who should be learned from. So am I. There's a lot of uh, people speaking the truth and motivation and sharing some things that people need to be understanding for themselves. Knowledge is free and knowledge is power. With power comes freedom. So, hey, God bless you. Choose love. Live without fear. Peace.